What's going on guys, I'm Motonocity, and this is my 2016 Honda Ruckus Mods Update. Before we get started, I gotta give a huge thanks to The Ruck Shop and ScooterWorks.com for providing the parts that you're gonna see on this build. If you need anything for your Ruckus, The Ruck Shop has pretty much everything. And ScooterWorks.com has a lot of stuff for Ruckuses and scooters in general. So check them out, I'll put their links in the description. Also, big thanks to Enigma Coatings, my powder coater of choice. Chris over there does all the powder coating work on any of the builds that you see on my channel. So huge thanks, check them out, and let's take a look at the build. To start out, I swapped in the 150cc four-stroke GY6, substituting an 11-pole stator and adding the 58.5 millimeter NCY cylinder head and their 61 millimeter big bore kit, bringing the motor to 171cc. I also painted the engine with VHT wrinkle black coating to clean things up. On the belt side, I've got the NCY Performance Clutch on a Snowflake Clutch Hub, the NCY Performance Variator and Drive Face, all surrounded by the Ruck Shop's Billet CVT cover that I had painted by Flak Design. Going over intake, I've got the Uni Clamp-On Air Filter feeding into a 28mm OKO slide carb, mounted to a 30mm intake manifold and an all-in-one manifold riser and angled clocking flange. For the exhaust, I've got the Ruck Shop's Yoshimura Pipe. Moving on to the wheels, we've got more goodies from the Ruck Shop. These are their old school polished wheels that I had powder coated gloss black with the rest of the bike by Enigma Coatings. The rear wheel sits on a stretch Michelin Power Pure SC 14070x12 and mounts up to the Danmax GY6 dual hub on a short axle for this fatty mod. And the front wheel sits on a 160x12 low profile Kingstone tire. To accommodate the stretch and fatty wheel mods, I've got the Ruck Shop's GY6 fatty extension mount kit. Motor is mounted up to this kit with the NCY low down shock. At the center are some TRS dress up pieces including their tank cover, frame splitter, side steps, frame guard, and frame caps. Underneath this is the Makuni fuel pump mounted to the TRS fuel pump and coil bracket. The seat was shaved and upholstered by Midnight Custom Cars and mounts up to the TRS low boy seat frame. At the rear of the seat is a flush mount taillight wired to the ATR GY6 wire harness running everything on the bike. At the sides are some aluminum foot pegs and a lower kickstand. Finishing up at the front, I've got the Ruck Shop's handlebar stem neck holding on to NCY handlebars. Mounted up to these handlebars, I've got the NCY bearing style throttle and grip set with a 78 inch slide throttle cable, a Honda Fit brake lever with brake switch, and the Stage 6 switch unit. The front end is dominated by the NCY triple tree and slammed front end kit, which includes their 200 millimeter rotor and four piston disc brake setup and front forks. Running to this caliper is a Goodridge stainless black brake line with their banjo bolts secured with Harley banjo washers. Rounding it out is the Ruck Shop's headlight lowering kit. And that's it. All the parts that I just mentioned are listed in the description, including some things that I didn't mention. If you want to see how this Ruckus was built, be sure to check out the Build Series playlist link I included as well. Again, I'm Odinocity. Be sure to hit that like button and subscribe, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.